All right, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I am your host, Ascentian Sword, bringing you some Path of Exile action. Just a little bit of casual play today. Um, I just, I got, I had an inkling for a, a build I wanted to try. I, I have this dream, well, dream. I guess I'll say goal of having at least one character from each, you know, each class of character, you know, at least, you know. To the end game at least level 90 91 and i realize i I've, I've been kind of top heavy on witches jug witches um forgot what this guy the marauder witches marauders and templars so i only have one um what's she called the huntress i don't know i'm forgetting the people's names so forgive me but anyway i only have one huntress lady i only have one woodsland lady I don't have a, a shadow, and so I wanted. I had a build idea in mind, and I didn't have a scion. So I'm like, okay, boom, it's time for scion. So, um, which this was this lady here, I only used to get skeletons, get me skeletons. But anyway, this is who I'm playing, the mistress of mystery. Not very mysterious. Really, I just summon skeletons and ghosts and let them do every, all the work. As you will see. Also, I haven't worn any fancy duds. No fancy gear, ladies and gentlemen. Just the raw stuff. So, where are we? I was here. I got to collect the body parts. I gotta collect the parts of the body. All right, we got some ore for the settlers. Money for the town. Come on, where are the body pieces? Ooh, that's nice. I keep, I'm so used to playing with the witch that I keep thinking that the scion is the witch, especially with the, her covered up, wearing the same armor, you can't tell 
you know, right at the quick glance. I mean, you can tell by, like, the stance they take, but if you're just, like, quick looking, well, hold on, let's use the skill point real quick. If you're just quick looking, um, it's difficult to tell that. Oh, yeah, that's right, the mana. There we go, baby. Intelligence, mana, 30% increase maximum mana. Good. Oh, wait, let's check our... I raised up my defenses recently. I was at the crafting table. I'm actually just just barely under lightning res. So anyway, let's go in and fight Siobhan. I shall preserve your beauty for eternity. Can I not have but a moment's respite? <laughs> Oh man. The world doesn't want your kind of beauty, Chevron. Usually with other builds, she could be a pain in the ass uh early game. But so far that's been the story with this uh minion build. It's like bosses that will be tricky or troublesome with other builds, at least in the beginning, then they just I mean, they can't even get started on her. It's like the minions do so much damage. It's like minion builds solve so many problems that other builds have that are just like mechanical problems. Like, number one, the one of the biggest uh, issues is that you're just one character while the enemies are multiple characters or they're bosses that can summon multiple guys or whatever. So it's like, technically, you're always outnumbered in the game. Even though you're powerful, you still, you're technically, you're outnumbered. Having a minion build solves that problem. You're not outnumbered. You outnumber the enemy. And then, number two, they, they can do things you can't do because you're afraid of dying. You know, they can take more damage. They, and, it, and it doesn't matter if they get cursed or set on fire or whatever. It's just like you just make more of them. If it's either they withstand, it's either they're sturdy enough to withstand whatever attack this coming against them. This one might be tricky because I don't have any chaos rays. It's either they they can withstand the attack that's coming against them, or it's not enough. To, or it, it does kill them and you just respawn them. So it's kind of like it doesn't matter whether it's powerful or weak. Well, well, nope, it kind of went the same as the others. I'm sorry, Malagaro, but I can be quite critical when it comes to art. What's another problem that they saw? Um, oh, they don't. <clears throat> since they're being run by the computer, like other builds, you have to shoot stuff or aim stuff, or you do a AOE or something like that. So you have to like m get the enemy. You have to aim for the enemy. You have to look for the enemy. Or so not all builds, because some things like spark or something like that you just um you know you, you can fill the room with up stuff but a lot of builds you have to like search for your enemy or move around with the minion build like the computer fights for you you don't have to aim you don't have to worry about something surprising you or anything like that the computer is never surprised
Oh, Doldrian. If you beef them up, I mean, they can't kill them faster than you can make them. So it doesn't even matter what damage they do to them. Oh my god, she didn't even get a chance to do her screaming move. Minion builds are just head. insane, man. And then it's like they beat totem builds and other types of multiple thing builds um, because totems don't move. So it's like they move around, they search for you. I mean, just damn. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's turn the turn in the body, the body parts. Can I not have but a moment's respite? No, you may not. Before we walk this path together, it's important that you understand one thing about me. I don't regret a single thing that I've done. Mm -hmm. I set out to raise humanity up from the cloying mud of its fleshly ignorance. My mistake was not in the aspiration, but in the execution. Now I intend to correct that mistake. Really, I'm not helping you, Exile. You're helping me. So, have you found those juicy organs for me yet? Yes, I have. Fate has a sick sense of humor, doesn't it? When I saw you that day in Axiom Prison, I genuinely thought it'd be for the last time. Yet here we are, the whore and the wonder child. Committing a mutual oh, she says she's a whore if you play the scion? Damn. Whoa. Because, like, if you play the other builds, you can find text documents and stuff that, you know, alludes to the fact that that's the kind of lifestyle she lives. But she never says it. If you play the scion, she just comes out and says she's a whore? Damn. All right, let's get some Malachi action on, y'all. Oh, come on. I get for trying to be a bloody hero. <coughs> Not that long ago, you represented all that I hated. But there you stand, possessing the one thing I have always dreamed of, a chance to change the world. Go on then, I've played my part. I ask the difficult questions. Now it is for you to get the answers. The only answer I need, Piety. The beast dies. With that, let us see if you truly understand what it means to be nightmare. You are being selfish. Accept the gift of immortality. Oh, 
No, I'm not. I'm giving you plenty of these guys to kick your butt. Beat him down, beat him down. All right, with that, ladies and gentlemen, I will end the video. I have been your host, the Sentient Sword. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourself. And have a great day.